Hello and welcome to the new The Witcher episode. My name is Larissa and today I'm going to react to the seventh episode from season two. And today it's my plan to actually finish this season. So I'm very excited yeah, to see how it's going to end and everything. I have been sick for the entire week, so maybe you can hear it in my voice um, or maybe not, but I feel like my voice is different. <laughs> it's no COVID, so no worries, but yeah, I think it's just a cold and uh, I have been feeling bad for the entire week. Um, this is the first day well, I still don't feel very good, but I feel better than the previous days. Uh, so I was like, today it's time for The Witcher. So let's finally finish this season because everyone has already finished it. Um, so that's what I'm going to do today. The last things we saw were that Jennifer and Geralt reunited. Um, and oh yeah, in the end, I'm a little bit confused because yesterday I edited the fourth episode. but So that's the last one I saw, but actually... I need to be thinking about sixth episode now. Uh, and that was the one where Yennefer escaped with Siri because Siri is kind of the key to get her magic back. And yeah, I was just so heartbroken for Geralt. Just the look on his face. That was so sad. And of course, Roach died, which I'm still not okay with. But yeah, that were kind of the most important things that happened in the previous episode. So I'm just going to continue watching now. If you already want to see the finale, that's possible. Uh, you can check out my Patreon, the links in the description. You can find uh, my reaction to the finale on there already. And you can also find uncut reactions to The Witcher, so my full reactions to the episode. And for now, I'm just going to watch this episode. So let's go. I get away. These men were off to Siri. My weapons. How did it break? Oh. She does that to things. Do you believe Yennefer means to harm the girl? I wish Yennefer knew of the balance you spoke of. But I learned my lesson about Yennefer and wishes. But we with Yennefer, you really never know. How can I help you? Give those weapons back. I need you to open a portal. Come and live, says she took me in. She was going oh. to me. Yeah. Should I try again? Get us back together. Yeah. That was impressive, but no. Adelaide sold them as clothes. Maybe they fled. Or maybe not. Oh. Uh. Oh, for real? Just because he was after her? No. No. We must go to Sigfra together. You see what happens to people who try to help me? I have to go alone. I will not be inside. If anything were to happen to you, they'll never forgive me. I really don't know what to think of Yennefer right now. That's right. Right now. <laughs> no. Chaos will be yours. Oh, that's creepy. Come back to bed. What's wrong? Nothing. Seriously, she is such a mess this season. I did not know she was sleeping with him. I will talk to them. You are not the commander. She should remember that. What the fuck? How are they ever going to find out that Dara is the spy? I'm no spy! Are you going to do it? Please. Or should I? Please, I need it. For fuck's sake. For real? They're just hanging them now? That's not okay. And you call yourself a leader. Why aren't they doing anything? Yeah, Dara, it's your fault. So Where is he? In a prison? Imagine having to guard your skin. Worst job. So you know what? No, cut your tongue out. Rude. <laughs> Guys, your harmonies were a little pitchy. Gordon, you're amazing. <laughs> Talent recognizes talent. Let's go again. Hey! Oh, awesome. oh my god! <laughs> you know what? We're trying to rehearse in here. Good sir, you would not know talent if I shoved it up your girl. Girl. <laughs> Are you sure? The last time we saw each other, you basically told me to fuck off. Down that hill, back to Cairngorm. Yeah. Don't 
fucking yasky at me I'm talking to you. This is how this works. I need your help. Fine. Gentlemen, it's been an honor. <laughs> what? I made new friends. <laughs> Get over it. Okay. It's immediately nice to see them back together. I really thought Yaskir wasn't gonna forgive him that easily. I'm not sure if he already did, but I thought he would treat him worse. He's not the social graces of a wild war, but he's, he's your protector. He's the father I never had. I don't feel alone anymore. I know what you mean. What was between you and Geralt? <laughs> Longing? Regret? Hope and fear. I don't think I've missed anything. So, you love him too. Let's go. Not just an elven baby, but one born from a mage. Only you could see a threat where everyone else sees a baby. <coughs> it's, it's a symbol of a beacon. Not to mention a, a potential enemy. Why well, I find it so very hard to believe that you came here simply to share gossip. Left. He is still alive? I was aided, of course. I'm I thought sure Gerald killed him, but now I'm not sure he didn't. Yes, mages have been practicing it for centuries. But I admit, my test subjects are normally dead. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh, bless okay. You. Great. <laughs> I'm beginning to smell like an Elfgardian's bullsack, so if you'll excuse me, hold this. <laughs> what was Jennifer doing in Oxenford? She was saving my life. What? Yeah, I know. She risked her life for me. You know, I was there was some deeper feeling for me beneath all that rage and hair. She had a lot of hair, that woman. <laughs> what was her angle? She lost her magic. Yeah, I know. It was great. Oh, unless she was lying. Fuck! Oh! Yaskir, you While you're traveling with Yaskir again, and you'll know it. Well, she sounds like a hoot. Who is the deathless mother, Geralt? Well, that's me. The first witch is what I had to imprison her. But someone's going to open up the door. That's someone being... She wouldn't. She uh... wouldn't. What? Sacrifice your child surprise to get her magic back? You bet your bloated biceps she would. Well, that's me as a demon that feeds on pain. I love how Yasuke just sees Geralt the worst in her and Geralt <coughs> tries to see the best in her. Someone really didn't like my shirt. <laughs> yup, and Zigrin. Oh. Your name's gone to shit. And if it isn't a white fucking wolf in a big fucking mouth. And I need a horse. Hello. Bro. What's the mission if you don't mind me asking? I do. <laughs> Secret kind. My favorite. Not my usual type. You'll do. Come on, boys! So they're joining him? That's so cool. Which is that? Ah. Just everyone's looking for Siri, and Siri oh, thinks she's cross. safe with Jennifer. Days wide, we don't have that kind of Lesson number two. Let's see what your chaos can do. Repeat after me. That's it. Now repeat. They live in our. How does she remember that? I would forget it after Yennefer said it. Oh my god! Ah! Uh, she's always going too far. Siri, stop! Stop! Oh no! I'm so sorry, but I know what happened. When you have power like this, never apologize. Did the horses go with them, or are those other horses? Information you told me about Siri, about what you saw me perform the door do so. Okay, so she actually went back there to. I need to know everything about the girl. Now, first. Not continue to put my girls at risk unnecessarily. I wouldn't ask you to if it wasn't necessary! Damn, okay. For aligning with Nilfgaard? Of course. For believing that you could have any impact there at all, my dear. I watched Citroen soldiers murder my kind. 
And now Janelle can't do the same. Oh, like that. I mean, now I'm complicit. He actually tells the owl the information and that's how they know. Seeing my people sing. Oh, the owl is telling them. I've had my dad. The owl is so cute yeah, though, his little face. All. all our heads will be on the top. What? <laughs> the dog. I have. I forget. The dog is having the time of his life. And where else could I have learned the paralytic qualities of nightshade? I'll have to mask it in a glass of meat. Whenever I'm just a light, just a stone. She was you to go sick. Seize it. <laughs> oh shit. <coughs> oh my voice. That is so fucked up. But I was just thinking about how annoying they were. So um, yeah, I think this is good. Oh, that must be terrible. Just not being able to move or do anything while you see everyone being killed in front of you. They're actually really doing what that woman is telling them. Kinda. Oh God. Our little spy Dara has had a change of heart. Look, I understand that what's a demon once they eat your child surprise and all. <laughs> and I'm happy to help say that. He just takes every every down. damn opportunity to say something bad about you. I guess I thought ignoring the serious existence would make everything better. I was wrong. I mean it's scared doesn't yeah. know how much He's he cares Siri. about Siri. Yeah, yeah, yeah with you sometimes. Oh yes, yeah. I'm so sad and complicated. Shut <laughs> That's a perfect impression of you, by the way. It's so great to have them back together. Look, it look the same. Everyone over now is gone. Yeah, that must be hard. Being back there, seeing all that. Remember what you have. Magic. It's lodged in you. Like a spike that right? It's a strange sort of thing. I just don't know if she means it well or not. I feel like she wants to be there for Siri because she kind of sees something of herself in her with discovering her magic and everything but yeah she's also doing this for her own purposes do what you have to do to seize your destiny what is happening turn back it's not too late and you, for me it is. This My is head. so weird. I thought I had to. So sorry, sir. Go, go. I didn't know who you were. I need to get to him. He's not here. Okay, she knows. He never was. <sighs> we were in trouble and needed help, and you betrayed us. I was stupid. I was selfish. You have to come with me. I don't trust you! Oh shit! Oh my god! Fuck! It's kind of forgot that Jennifer only decides to do the right thing when Siri finds out what she was doing. Oh my god! No, if they get Siri, that's. Oh no, Jennifer, you don't even have power, come on! Oh. And they're captured. Oh shit! <laughs> The hot thing. This hurts me, seeing Carol and Jennifer like this. Ah, the child surprise! I've had so much. Uh, <laughs> like Bad <father> timing. <laughs> like father, like daughter. The girl. Yours. Mine. <laughs> Mine, sacred. 
turn your back to the forest. Hut, hut. Turn your front to me. Hut, oh shit. Hut. No. No. So now everything would happen because of that witch. What the hell? That just gets undone now or something like that. It's a house with legs. Oh shit. More monsters. Oh my god guys this ending was so good i'm so excited for this last episode now but first let's do a review on this one. Oh my god especially the last 10 minutes were just amazing uh i gotta say the the first part of the episode it was nice but yeah sometimes i just feel like there's too many politics on the storyline of uh, to say yeah and all those people I mean I know it's necessary but I also feel like they could like um, shorten it a bit but I did like the the part where uh, Fringilla killed those men because they were really annoying me but actually I first want to talk about the ending because that was so good I really thought those guards would capture them now and they would just get imprisoned and I don't know what would have happened after but nothing good uh, but just the way Geralt came to say it, a lot of times when something bad is happening, I just see it coming. And then I'm like, oh, Geralt will be here any minute and everyone will be fine. Uh, but this time I really didn't see it coming. I really thought, okay, they're going to be captured now and uh, that's it. That's just it for them. But then there was Geralt and Yaskir and, and his, his army, well, army, few dwarves. Who are good fighters. So that was just really amazing to see. Yeah, and just the, the look on Ciri's face when she saw Geralt. And I just, I felt so many emotions like Geralt is always protecting Ciri. And he cares so much about there. And also Yennefer called him her protector in this episode. And then to just see him again and to rescue her again. And and then to actually hear Yaskir say, oh, like father, like daughter. And I just love their bonds so much. It's so amazing. I love them so much. And she actually said that he was the father to her she never had. And I'm just like, yeah, so nice. So nice. I'm having a, a lot of trouble talking right now, as you might be able to hear. And during the episode, I also noticed that I wasn't feeling as well as I thought in the beginning. But I still really want to finish this now. So I'm going to watch the ep last episode uh, now but yeah there were a few more things I, I wanted to discuss but i shouldn't make it too long because my voice is just really shitty let's see if we we look at this episode from the start um well let's start actually just let's start about the part where yaskir and gerald um met again i gotta say this season is so good with with gerald's entrances and and people seeing him again while they didn't expect to be seeing him. Just the way Yaskir was singing and then he was mad at the guard and he stood up and he looked next to him and it was Geralt. And he was just, oh Geralt. And then they hugged and I really didn't see that coming because I thought, okay, I knew Yaskir was really mad. Um, but I really didn't think he would immediately just hug him. But he also kind of saved him out of that prison. So, uh, and now they're back together and it took a long time because there's only one episode left and in the the seventh episode they only meet but i thought it would be earlier but i'm still really happy that they're back together now um and immediately just yaskir just keeps talking i mean you know you're traveling with yaskir <laughs> and then they met with the dwarves it was really nice that they wanted to help him that was really nice to see and i gotta say i also really liked the storyline of Siri and yennefer um like i said during the episode i kind of feel like Yennefer sees something in her of herself in Ciri, like the trying to control her magic, trying to yeah, just learning all that stuff. And it was nice to see her help her and and that she's yeah, she learns those spells and then she actually does something she wants to do herself with the magic uh, instead of it just happening to her. Uh, but Ciri always goes too far and she's super dedicated to learn everything and to fight and do everything right. But um, 
yeah Siri really needs to know when to stop and that's I think her biggest obstacle right now yeah and then she found out about uh, yeah, what was happening? Why Yennefer actually took her there? Actually, the, the way Geralt held his sword against Yennefer's throat, that hurt me. I mean, I really like them together. And um, yeah, I, I just, I shipped them. But right now, I'm not like so sure because she did a lot of fucked up things. But I mean, it's Yennefer. We, we're kind of used to that. But I think this uh, went a little bit too far. I mean, Siri just means the world to Geralt. And if you're going to hurt Siri, then uh, Geralt is going to hurt you no matter how much he cares about you. And in the end, we saw that the elven baby was killed. And I really didn't like that because I was so happy when it was born. Uh, an elven baby hadn't been born in such a long time and everyone was so happy and there was new hope. And... It was so, I mean, it was a baby with elven ears and I thought that was pretty cute. No, beside that, it's just, um, yeah, it's kind of fucked up to, to see that happening. Because uh, we were really looking forward to that child being born. And then it finally gets born and, and now this happens. Because that witch, she, if they did certain things, they would get stuff in return. Like Yennefer bringing Siri there and then that would be the key to getting her magic back. And I feel like now that Yennefer didn't complete that... And uh, now she said those words and that now all of that is being undone or something like that. Or they're like, I don't know how to explain it. And I also don't know if I'm right, but that's just uh, how I feel like it is right now. But I, I could be really wrong. I don't know. I think that was my reaction uh, to this episode for now. I'm really excited for the last one. I gotta spare my voice a bit. I really hope I can do a nice review about the finale, but right now I feel like um, shit. But yeah, we're just going to try it. Um, if you already want to see the finale, like I said, check out my Patreon. And then that was it. Uh, did you like it? Then please leave a like, subscribe. And then uh, I really hope to see you at the finale. Bye.